What's up, guys? Calvin Becerra here, live from Barcelona, Spain. My plane just landed. I just got to my hotel. Let's see how many people we can get online right now on the live line. Let's see. Let's just wait a, wait a few seconds. See what's going on. What's up, everybody? I literally just got to Spain right now. And I want to do this live for you guys because I know that February 1st is right around the corner and I think that's when most people are going to start their 90 day run. Hopefully you guys have been preparing, pre-launching, getting your people ready. Uh, but I want to kind of go into some of the some of the uh, the things you need to do in order to, get, to launch out your 90 day run. I've been traveling around the world. What's up everybody? Where are you guys calling in from? We got We got Belgium. Let us know where you guys, we got Italy in the house, United States. Okay, let us know where you guys are, are, are tuning in from so all the other 90 day runners can see uh, Albania, see where you guys are. There's people all around the world getting ready to run. Network marketing is huge. There are millions and millions of people around the world who want to change their lives through this profession, network marketing. Uh, so why not do a 90 day run, right? So I want to do this thing with you guys. I want to be kind of like your mentor, but I'm going to be running with you guys. Everything I teach is going to be everything I'm doing as well. So, uh, but I want you guys uh, to have me as, I guess, your, your running partner, right? So uh, let's uh, let's wait for everybody to get on. We got San Diego in the house, Italy, Maryland, the Netherlands. I love it. I'm actually in Spain right now. See, I don't think you guys can see outside, maybe because uh, of the reflection in the glass. But I'm in Spain, so maybe I can let you guys see a little bit of it. I'm in Barcelona, Spain. I just got here. Was able to practice a little bit of my Spanish, a little bit that I know. My last name is Spanish, and it's a shame I can't even speak it fluently, right? Of course. All right, guys, so what up, Ricky? We got everybody on the line. I'm seeing your names fly by. Some of you I've seen over the last few days traveling through Italy, Germany, now coming to Spain. This, this, this hotel that I'm in is called the, uh, what is it called? Let's see. It's called the Barcelo Sans. And uh, the theme is a space station, which is kind of weird, but inside my room, they want you to feel like you're inside a spaceship, like on the International Space Station or something like that. Um, I don't know, it's kind of a weird theme, but uh, look at this thing right here. It looks like I'm looking out of the spaceship at the sun. Uh, it's kind of weird. Let me, let me kind of show you guys the hallway of, of this hotel, okay? It's kind of a modern hotel, but it's like you're in, you're in a space station, so check this out. Weird, right? I don't know. Whatever. But I literally just got into my room. So cool. So we should. I look. Got a. We got a bunch of people on um, online right now. So make sure you share this Facebook Live uh, with people. All right. Make sure you share it with your friends, the people that are running, whoever's missing it right now. Don't worry. I'll post it to my Facebook page. For those of you that are running, go to the90dayrun.com so you can download your uh, 90 day run. Uh, uh, goals tracker sheet. You can. It's a kind of an accountability sheet. You can have your your teammates fill, uh, download it as well and print it out because you guys want to use that during the 90 day run. So that way you can track your progress. You can track your activities. You can also uh, hold people accountable. You know, if people aren't having the results that they want, you can kind of look at their tracker sheet and see what they've been doing. Most people who do nothing get nothing. <laughs> That's usually the answer of most people's problems in this business. Uh, when they're when they're when they're complaining or they're getting no results, it's usually a lack of activity or a lack of the right types of activity, right? Some people confuse uh, being busy uh, with being productive, right? Just because you're busy doesn't mean you're going to get results. You got to be very, very productive in what you're doing and you got to do those income generating activities when you're running for the 90 days. Now for the last, I would say three or four weeks, I would say probably three weeks since I did my first Facebook Live with you guys uh, regarding the 90 day run, I talked to you guys about pre-launching uh, your your 90 day run, right? Going out there, finding people who are already on your team, existing members who are wanting to have success in their business and finding those people and letting them know, hey, you know what? 
There's not a better time than right now that we plan a 90-day run. It's the brand new start of a brand new year, 2018. Let's let, let this be the year we have our breakthrough, right? That's what you guys want, the breakthrough year, right? Maybe some of you have been in network marketing for a long time and you haven't made the decision to go all out in a massive way. Make this your year. What are you waiting for, right? And time isn't on our side, right? We're losing time every single day. Every year is flying by. If your goals aren't being accomplished, then you need to do something different in your life. And... Uh, how about run for 90 days? Like, how about apply yourself and at least say, you know what? I did network marketing. I put my all out massive heart effort and soul into this business in a massive way. And I got the results that I finally was looking for, right? And if some of you guys are by yourself on this 90 day run, who cares? At least at the end of 90 days, you won't be by yourself anymore if you're really going to apply yourself in the right way. For those of you guys that have teams, right? Those of you guys that have existing members on your, in your organizations, Go grab those guys and tell them, let's run for 90 days. You know, let's, let's be the example for all the new people that are going to enter in our business over the next few months so they know what real work ethic is like. And uh, so for 90 days, you're going to be running. But during this pre-launch phase, which was the last three weeks up until this next week, uh, starting the beginning of February when you're going to start running, is when you should be getting people involved saying, hey, guys, there's no better time than the run right now. Let's start an initiative. Let's do a 90-day run. Let's change the level of our activity. Let's sacrifice some of our, let's sacrifice the next 90 days of our life to this business, right? And don't let excuses get in the way. Don't uh, let the, the, the fact that you have a family, that you have children, that you have a husband and a wife to take care of, that you have a full-time job, that you have a business that you're running, uh, that you own, uh, get in the way of, of your success in network marketing because uh, some people use excuses as a, as, as a thing to stop them and other people use excuses as a way to motivate them, right? That's the difference between successful people and unsuccessful people. Successful people take every reason why people say they can't do it and they use it as a motivation to do it, right? If you look at successful people in life, you'll find that almost all of them have families. They have kids. They have a husband and wife. They have a full-time job they're working. They have a business or multiple businesses that they own and operate, but they use those as reasons to make this thing work so they don't have to use those as excuses, right? So that's that's the thing. Uh, successful people just have a different mindset, different mentality. You have to switch the mentality to thinking positive, to letting those things that stop people be the things that motivate you, all right? So you should have been getting people that are wanting to run with you on the same page as you saying, okay, this is the date we're gonna run, February 1st. We're gonna run all the way through February, March, end of April, May 1st is the end of our 90 day run. Let's see where we can get, right? So the first thing you got to do is when you're getting these people involved and you're getting them motivated is you got to give them a reason to run. And some of the stuff I'm going to share with you is, is some of the stuff I've been sharing with my team over the last two and a half weeks as I've been traveling throughout Europe. I'm going to be going to, I'm in Spain right now. I'll be going to, uh, to Portugal next. Then I will be ending in the Middle East in Dubai, one of my favorite places to travel, guys. Uh, and I'll be sharing some pictures and some stuff with you guys. If you guys are on Snapchat, you guys can follow me on there as well. Instagram, Facebook, you know. Um, but, um, you know, when I'm doing this 90-day run, I'm keeping it generic because I want people from all companies to be able to learn how to do these 90-day runs so they can become successful in whatever company they are. You know, I don't ever talk bad about companies. I believe in all products in network marketing. Uh, the network marketing companies are amazing. Their products are amazing. And the reason why they had to take the product through the channel of network marketing is because there's a story to tell of those products. A two-minute uh, commercial on television doesn't do the product justice. It's about word-of-mouth advertising. It's about sharing stories and testimonies and sharing people's product experiences with people or service experiences with people that get people to, to invest in those types of products, right? So anyways, guys, um, I want to, uh, for you guys' for you guys' sake, I want to go through, you know, why, uh, you know, a 90-day run, what, what we really need to be doing. And let me get this for you guys. One second. I want to give you guys some information that I shared with my team, and I want to go into a little bit more of depth as well. So that way you guys are on the same page as me. So first thing you got to do is you got to identify a reason to run. Like, why are you running? You can't just go get your team and say, hey, let's do a 90-day run uh, because Calvin said so or because Eric Worre talks about the 90-day run and, and because he does it in his trainings. Let's do a 90-day run. No. You got to pique the interest of your team. Like, why are you running for 90 days? And every single person in every company has a different reason. But the reason why I've been successful in network marketing and why most of my leaders have been successful is because 
Every 90 days, we change it up for our team. Like, we don't do the 90-day run once a year. Like, we're constantly doing 90-day runs four times a year, right? We're doing those. Every quarter is an opportunity for you to run 90 days. And if you can continue to, to adjust your sale and change the reason why you're running every 90 days, you keep your teams motivated, you keep them excited, you keep them from getting bored, you keep them from falling off the, 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 the end of the cliff. And then in between those 90 day runs, usually your company or, or yourself as leaders or your teams are throwing big massive events to keep them energized, to recharge their batteries, to refuel their, uh, their fuel tanks, right? And that's, that's what you really need to do, guys. So what's the reason to run? And every 90 days have a new reason, but what's your reason uh, during this 90 day period? Okay, it could be a new product. Maybe your company just launched at your last event a brand new product, right? Are you taking those products seriously? Did you just uh, go to the event and see your company launch a brand new product or service and you just buy it yourself and that was it? Or did you go all in, invest in those products or that service and go out and promote the heck out of that, the, that product? That's an opportunity for you to run for the next 90 days. Take that as an opportunity to go promote the heck out of that product or service for the next 90 days and do an all out campaign for 90 days with you and your team. Just focus on that one product and see where it gets you over the next 90 days. Hey, maybe your 90 day run is focused around a new trip. Maybe your company just launched a brand new promotion and you're going to go to, you know, to, to Spain, right? The, your company's going to offer a trip to Spain or maybe the Caribbean or maybe a really cool cruise. Uh, you know, or maybe an, an, an exotic destination ac across the world, or maybe somewhere cool in the U.S. or wherever your country is, wherever you're living. Maybe there's there's some really cool trip promotion your company's throwing, and it requires you guys to do some effort on your part to maybe accumulate some points to get the free travel, or to hit a rank, or to hit a level, or to accumulate some type of sales, or to get a certain amount of customers to win that rank. How about you guys just get as much information on that on that travel destination as you can, and sell the heck out of it to your team. Right? Let them know that, man, all the people that have been watching us do network marketing over the last six months, over the last six years, they're watching what we're doing. Isn't it, wouldn't it be great if we all won this trip together to this exotic destination this company's sending us to or even wherever it is? And so those people that have been watching us see, wow, those people are winning. Now I'm going to pick up the phone or I'm going to send them a message saying, hey, I want to join whatever you're doing. I've been watching you and I see you're winning. Let's do this thing, right? So maybe it's a trip promotion and that's the reason you're running for the next 90 days. Or maybe it's a, a new rank, right? Maybe you've been focused on this rank that you wanted to hit, but you know in order to hit that rank in your company, you need other people on your team to be successful as well. So how about rather than focusing on your rank, you focus on a few people, a few key, key people in your organization that you know really want to succeed, that really have been applying themselves, and you go in-depth and you go help those people accomplish their goals over the next 90 days. So at the end of the day, you've accomplished yours, right? New ranks, that's something to run for. Maybe it's a big event, a big event coming up. What's your big event coming up in your company over the next 90 days? It could be right after the 90 day run. It could be right before the 90 day run ends. Maybe you have a run straight to that, to that level. I know, um, one of my uh, parts, areas of my business is in Europe, right? And we have a big event in Berlin and it's perfectly ends right after the 90 day run. So we have what's called the road to Berlin right now and everybody's running to Berlin and they want to, they, they want to have as much success as they can over the next 90 days so they could showcase their team in Berlin across all the teams in our company so they could say, we just worked our asses off over the last 90 days and look at us now. We're walking across the stage as these new pins. We're all winning these new trip promotions. We won the cash bonuses. That's what hard work does. It pays off at the end and we had this road to Berlin. So what is it that you're running for? Do you have a big event you can run for that ends right when this 90 day run ends or maybe right before it ends so that way it's on the road to the end of that 90 day run, you're going straight through that event and you're succeeding, right? You're showing everybody what you're doing. Massive action, guys. Or maybe it's a cash bonus. Maybe there's some type of cash bonus your company's offering right now as an incentive for you to win right now. Can you run for that big bag of cash, guys? Or maybe you're a leader in your organization and you and a group of leaders get together and you guys plan a promotion for your team with cash or prizes or trips or a team trip or a team getaway or some type of private team thing for the leaders that win. Maybe you can do a big promotion for the next 90 days and the, the leaders that win get to win those prizes, whatever they are, right? And you can use that 90 day run tracker sheet on my website, the, the 90dayrun.com. You can download it and you can use some of those income generating activities as they get points and you, they can prove to you that they really earn those points. Maybe you can use that point system to give away prizes to your team, right? So that's what you can do. Or maybe it's a, a new year, right? January 
2018, February 1st, we're starting this 90 day run. You've been pre-launching through January. Most people, um, they, they wait to get started until the new year. And it's not a better time than right now. They wait to get their goals started. They wait to, 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 they put their dreams back on the table when it's a brand new year, a fresh new start. And now they want to run. So what better than do at the beginning of the year to launch their business off the beginning of the year through that first quarter to take them through the next three quarters so they can have ultimate success throughout. So you got to have a real reason to run, guys. You got to have a real reason to run and you got to keep things simple, okay? During this 90 day run, it's not, it's not the time when you're going to complicate things. It's not the time when, when you got to go, you know, out there and do everything for everyone. You're going to empower your teammates, right? To run for 90 days. You're going to, you're going to get all the tools you have from your company or from your team or what you've developed that keeps things simple. And you're going to empower those people, put the tools in their hands to start going to do those things on their own, to start doing the one on one meetings with prospects that are on their own, to start doing the three way calls with, with, with their teammates and prospects on the phone, to start doing their own online webinars, to start doing their own meetings. What tools do you have to be able to equip these people on your team who are running to go do some of these, these things themselves? Don't be the one man show. Don't be the person with the best presentation in the room and your team depends on you. Anytime you have the opportunity to share the business with, with your teammates or with their prospects, keep it as simple as possible. Whatever you're doing, make the prospect in the room or the teammate on your side think whatever he or she just did, I can do myself. So when the 90 day run happens, they can do those things. So what presentations can you put in the hands for your people? What PowerPoints can you put? What videos are very simple to show your business, your products, your services in an easy way that you're just telling them to send out the prospects, right? What follow up tools do you have? Right. Also, as a leader, are you setting up webinars for this 90 day run? Are you going to have that one weekly webinar that showcases the plan to new prospects? And are you going to get individual leaders trading off on those webinars during the week? Do you have a team call on the weekend where you guys can show off all the people who are running and their successes so you can get multiple people on the line sharing their wins for the week? I enrolled the two new customers this week. I got a brand new person this week. I got three prospects in the funnel that are looking at our business this week. You know, I just had an incredible meeting where 10 new people showed up with five new guests and they all joined, whatever it is. Like you got a leadership call at the end of the week. You got a, a monthly training, a getting started training for all the new distributors that have come into your business this week. What do you guys got going on? What is, do you guys have it laid out and planned for this 90 day run so it runs smoothly and clean? Trust me, you're gonna have roadblocks, you're gonna have dead ends during the 90 day run, but there's nothing better than running out all out in a massive way for 90 days having failures, but just getting better as a network marketer, developing those skills as a network marketer. There's nothing better than that, guys. So just know this, no matter what happens at the end of the 90 days, you're going to end up better than you, you were when you, before you started. You're going to end up better than where you started. That's what I want you to know. You're going to become a better network marketer. If you want to become a professional in this business, you got to put your 10,000 hours in and the clock is going to start on February 1st when you launch that 90 day run, guys. Okay, that's what you need to do. And for some of you, you might say, I need a couple more weeks to pre-launch. Maybe you guys need to start on March 1st, whatever it is. Then you could do that. But just remember, once you get started, don't look back. Only look forward, guys. All right, so have a plan in place. Have a plan in place for your teammates, right? I like to say two a day, 10 in play. That's the minimum that people should be doing when they're out prospecting for their business. Two new prospects a day looking at your business, your products, your services in some sort of way. It's going to take you picking up that phone and calling multiple people, sending messages to multiple people before two people say, yeah, I'd love to take a look at your service or I'd love to try your products or I'd love to take a look at the video regarding your business, right? It's going to, that's where the, the time is going to be consumed on your part going out and prospecting. And if you have a full-time job, if you have a family you're taking care of, don't worry about it. Don't let that be an excuse. In between, you have the free time. That's the time you're going to sacrifice to give towards your business. And remember, those of you guys that are running, get permission from your husband, get permission from your wife, get permission from your kids to run for the next 90 days. Let them know that mom or dad is going to be busy for the next 90 days. I'm not neglecting you. I'm doing this for you. I'm doing this for us. At the end of the 90 days, this is what I expect to, to, to happen for me in my life, for us in our life. And this is what we can do. Maybe you can reward your family with a trip. Maybe you can reward your family with something that's an incentive because they gave that time to you and they rooted you on. They cheered you all the way across the finish line. This is what we're going to, this is what's in it for us at the end. Maybe, maybe there's, a, there's some type of incentive or reward at the end of this 90 90 days that you're going to do with them because they allowed you to do this, right? Get the whole team on board inside your house, guys. Let your friends know you're running. You're not neglecting them. I'm running for the next 90 days because I want to change my life. That's what I want to let you know. That's what you guys got to do, right? But 
I'm telling you, when you're out there building that list, be conscious of the people that you're interacting with every day. Forget your friends and family that have told you no. Some of them have said, yes, I know, but be conscious of the interactions you have every day in your life for over the next 90 days. Add those people's name to your list. You don't need to share your products or service or business with them yet, but build a relationship with them. Visit them time and time again. Ask them to go to lunch sometime. Maybe you guys both have kids and you guys can have a play date with your kids, you know? Maybe you met a, a, a really cool friend and maybe, you know, He's, he's married, you're married, you guys go have, have, a, have a dinner date some night, right? Get to know each other. Those types of things, you got to be smart when you think about it, right? Interact with the parents at your kid's school, the parents at, on the sports teams, the teachers at the school, the person you do the dry cleaning with, right? Have a little bit more of a conversation with people over the next 90 days and start building some relationships, guys. But remember, when that list is built, you're focused on two a day, right? Two new prospects today, looking at your business, service, products, whatever it is. Do not put your head down on the pillow at night until two people have taken a look at your business or two people have received an email or have received some product or have received some information on, on your business, okay? Products and services or services. And that's what your goal is, right? At least five days a week, 10 new people in the pipeline. And guess what? This is what your time is going to be consumed with. It's not that part. The part that your time is going to be consumed with is following up with those people who have been looking at your business. Moving them from the first exposure to the next exposure, whatever that is. Maybe it's a call. Maybe it's a, con a team conference call. Maybe it's a webinar they can get on to see your business. Maybe it's a home meeting. Maybe it's a one-on-one -on -one with you to meet them personally to show them your business one-on-one. -on -one. You know, And then you move them to the next exposure. Maybe that exposure is you signing them up, you taking them through the sign-up process as a customer or distributor. Maybe it's you dropping off some product. Or, or meeting with them to share, to share with them, you know, some testimonies regarding your company's services, whatever it might be, all the way up until the final exposure where you're signing them up, right? The follow-ups are the key. And if you practice that two a day, then you're always going to have people to follow up with each day who, who, are, who are looking at your business, all right, guys? So two a day, 10 in play, right? Two a day, at least five days a week, you got 10 people in the pipeline. For those of you that want incredible breakthroughs, you want to be at the top, in your company, you guys gotta you guys gotta do even more than that. You guys gotta do more than what you've been doing, more than what normal is, more than what normal people in this business are teaching you. You gotta do it even more. For me to become successful in network marketing, I learned everything I could from the most successful people, and I learned what they were doing, when they were doing, how much of it they were doing, and I told myself I'm gonna do more than that. And that's how I've got to the top. That's how I've built my business four times over the last 12 years in this business. You know, launching my business over and over again. But you got to decide what level of action you guys are going to take, okay? Because And you got to really identify with what level you've already been taking in your business. So there's four different levels of action, right? You got normal, you got the people who retreat. No, you got the people who do nothing, you got the retreaters, you got the people who operate at normal level of activity, and you got the fourth level, which is massive, right? And you got to decide, first you got to, you got to, uh, you got to tell yourself, uh, what level that you're operating at and what that you've been at, operating at. And then after this Facebook Live I'm doing, you got to decide at what level you're going to take your business moving forward, right? And the first level most people take is, is called... Uh, the, or is, is called nothing. Obviously, people who do nothing get nothing, but there are people who do nothing. And believe it or not, doing nothing requires a lot of action on your part, right? Doing nothing. Imagine all the people who make the excuses in your business or on your teams. They've joined you. They went all in with you, but they do nothing. They say, oh, you know, I can't do it because of this, or I'm not good at talking, or I don't know anybody, and blah, 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 right? They make up every excuse and they hold themselves back their entire life. But guess what? That takes a lot of energy. All of those excuse makers that do nothing, they have to sit back where they continue to make excuse after excuse after excuse while they watch people succeed. While they watch the people who can make the same excuses as them go out and make it happen, go out and take action, and go out and succeed. Oh my gosh, that's, that's, that's draining their energy. They're sitting making excuses, watching people become successful while they do nothing. That takes a lot of energy, and that's actually action on their part, but it's giving them no results, right? And then the next type of action taker, those are the people who retreat. Those are the people who go to all the events, they go to the meetings, they're on all the webinars, they're on all the phone calls, they're reading all the material. They're so inspired, so motivated, but they always ask that internal question, well, what if I do everything they've taught me and nothing happens? What if I go all in for the next 90 days and I fail? What if I do this 90 day run with him or her and I don't accomplish my goal? And what happens at the end of the day is they just take a step back and they retreat from actually taking action at all and they get no results at all. They, 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 they retreat 
and they, 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 they spend all that energy questioning themselves and they back up into a corner and they do nothing at all. And that takes a lot of action on their part as well. And then you have the third action taker. This is the person that operates at normal. This is the normal. This is 90% of the people in network marketing. They watch everything. They learn everything. They're doing everything, but in just tiny little amounts. Okay, it's normal level of action. And they're the people that, those are the people that come up to me and say, Calvin, I've been in network marketing now for two or three years and I've got no results. I've been in network marketing for eight years and I'm just waiting for my breakthrough. But the reality is, is that they're doing the things you teach, but at very minuscule levels. We're, I'm talking about 90 days of all out massive action. And over the last three years, if they were to count how many days they've actually applied themselves, you can't even count to 90 over the last three years with those types of people, right? There are people that say, oh, I've been, I've been in network marketing now for three months and I haven't gotten any results. But in actuality, they've only applied themselves 10 days over the last three months, right? People go an entire week in their network marketing business and they go to one meeting on a Thursday night and they think, oh, I didn't get any results last week. But all they applied themselves was to the Thursday night. That was it. So you got to get real with yourself, right? The fourth level is massive. Right, And this is the only level of action I've ever known my entire life is massive action. Since I was an eight-year-old kid working to help my mom uh, get money to pay, to pay the bills, to a 15-year-old working three jobs a day to pay for my own private high school, to going to college and, and playing sports and getting top grades in my classes my, at the university to be the first person in my family to graduate, working multiple job after multiple job after multiple job while other kids are just in their room doing their homework, hanging out, partying at night because their parents are giving them money every week. You know, massive action is all I know. And that's why I'm at where I, that's why I'm, I'm at the level I'm at in my life right now. Everything I've ever done is massive. And that's why I've always got massive results. So what type of results do you want in your business? What type of example do you want to be for all those new people who join your team that you say, you can be just as successful as him. You can be just as, as successful as her if you join our company, but you're not even operating at a massive level and, and, and taking action in your business so they have no one to follow they have no they have no guide they have no lighthouse to look towards when they want to know how do I build my business remember at the level and pace you build your business those people are going to decide the level and pace they build their business so what are you doing in order to succeed so massive you guys have to decide for those of you that want breakthroughs in your business and in your life you have to you have to apply yourself in a massive way at whatever you're focused on and you have to make the decision to yourself that if I'm going to move forward and be successful I got to operate at a massive level regardless of what the people around me are doing all right and that's what you guys have to do Okay, so decide your goal. What are you running for? Get the people on your side, on your team, running for that same goal. Have that same vision. Bring new people along with you saying, hey, there's not a better time than to join our company than right now because we're all running for this goal. We want you to do it with us. We're doing this 90-day run and we're doing it all out in a massive way. We got webinars. We got phone calls. We got meetings going on during the week. We got people running at like light speed. There's no better time to get involved in us right now to get involved in this freaking hurricane right now so you can end up 90 days from now farther than, when you, farther than where you would be if we weren't running this 90 day run right now is the best time for you to get involved in our company. If you were ever wanting to get involved in our company, it's right now. And that's what you guys have got to be doing. Okay. And you got to have that time frame. It's 90 days. It's 90 days. And then 90 days from now, when you're done, you can look back and say, wow, look at the results I've got. If any, look at the results I've got, look at the skill levels that I've developed over the last 90 days. And guess what? You can do it all over again, but now you can run for something new. What is something new I can run for? Is it a new product? Is it the next event? Is it a cash bonus? Is it a trip incentive my company's company's throwing? You know, what is it? What is is it? You know, is it is it the time of year, right? What is it that you can run for for the next 90 days, guys? And then you got to put it all together. You got to apply yourself in all those income income generating activities, and you got to have high energy wherever you're at. People got to be attracted to what you're doing. You got to be like this. Freaking fireball of energy so people are like, I, I don't know what the heck this thing is, but I'm doing whatever he's doing, right? And, and that's what I try to do for my team. That's that's what I want to be for you guys on these Facebook Lives that I do weekly during this 90-day run. And just get excited. When your team's um, running with you, tell them, hey, follow Calvin Becerra. He's doing these 90-day run Facebook Lives. That's going to keep you motivated. Go to the 90dayrun.com, the 90dayrun.com. Download his tracker sheet so we can all hold each other accountable so you can keep progress of what you've been doing during the week so you can answer yourself as to why you're getting the success you're getting or why you're not getting the success you're getting. And just get ready because we're going all out in a massive way. Guys, so remember, I've, I'm giving you guys all the information to succeed, but this is just knowledge. This is just information, right? You know, but... The information and the knowledge isn't enough. 
And I want to leave you guys with a, with a quote by Tony Robbins, right? And Tony Robbins says it perfectly. He says, knowing is not enough. The path to success is to take massive, determined actions. And that's what you guys have to decide to do today. You guys got to go out and you got to get your team on board during this pre-launch phase. Get everybody on board. Get everybody uh, ready for the 90-day run. Downloaded the 90-day run tracker sheet. Get them focused on watching the Facebook Lives. You guys got to be those 90-day runners too. Do some of the things I'm doing for you, for your teams, right? Start promoting the 90-day run so we can do this every single year. Remember, I'm running every 90 days, but once a year, I'll be doing this 90-day run, run with you guys all around the world from all companies in this generic fashion, right? But I want to motivate you guys, whether you guys are promoting products or whether you're promoting services. I want to run this thing with you guys. I want to do the 90 day run with you guys. So, hey, you guys, I wish you guys the best of luck. I'm going to be running with you guys. You know, get your get your jogging pants off now. Get on the starting blocks. We're, we're about to run February 1st. We're taking off in a massive way, guys. For some of you guys who want to start later, you can. But I'm just telling you, February 1st, we're taking off in a massive way. And we're not going to look back. We're looking straight towards the finish line, guys. We're going we're gonna to finish with some great results. We're going to finish with some increased skill sets. And we're going to be able to log those hours on the way to 10,000 hours to you becoming a network marketing professional. I love you guys. I want to build up this profession. I want you guys to all be so successful. I thank you guys for tuning in, guys. And I see, I'm gonna, I see all you guys' comments. I'll be watching them. I'll be reading them. And I, I just appreciate all you guys. And I want you guys to succeed. Because when you guys succeed, our industry succeeds. And we can make it bigger and better than it already is. All right, guys. Good luck. God bless. Thank you guys for joining. See you guys later. Mwah. Signing out from Barcelona, Spain. See you guys.